So in the Green Tar Charity Shop, offshoot of Himalayan Center, I found the blue coat. Like Peacoat, young Jack Kerouac wore. Merchant Marine, WW2, Big Danger, North Atlantic, against the way freezing sea and sky, blow, blow, blow like crazy. And checking the label, found coat made in Italy by Sartori, Gino Sartori. Hey, how like Sartori, eh? And it had a whole right breast. Could it be moth bite or cigarette burn? Kenny, the shop man, said, it's a flower hole for funeral, coat for funeral. And you need a flower. So conjuring guy wearing wool and cashmere coat and gouging a hole for a rose, to my mind, for a funeral. Oh, yes, forgot to tell you. I had come to the shop from the Himalaya Center where I coffeed and caked with Stuart, who was mourning Dave, his oldest and best friend, whose funeral Stuart, Angelica and Saul had gone to day before. Oh, yeah, I forgot to tell you. After Stuart left, I stayed a bit in the Himalaya. When Leo Bruges came in, Dad to Norbu, Ro Norbu Rose, Norbu on his back, Rika, Mom, behind the counter, an older woman came in and sat at table next to me. I said how Norbu was part of the cafe, Norbu Rose, that is. And the woman said yes and told same to Rika. And there in the Himalaya, I recall, or in the Green Tara, I recall when Kenny told me what he told me, the hole was for a, I filled in, rose for a funeral, a little vision. So I laid the blue coat open, showed Kenny the label. So too I told Kenny about Jack and Satori. So too for Kenny I sang, old Dave Van Ronk's Zen Koan's Gonna Rise Again. For this is Satori, the end of desire, to hold the in the gutter with a curse. Oh, oh. Him, him, I say. Jack Shea, old friend, died eight years back from that green Tara Himalaya, 5 October, we think, day. Recall now, too. Jack Shea was friend of Stewart's, too. Recall the three of us together in maybe 1987 in the meadows, met, sat on a bench, or stood, read bits of our barred stuff, bold caraway, wore black felt flat cap, I did, brown leather flyers jacket, did Jack, Stewart's scarf, red October in the railroader, etc., <clears throat> etc. When Jack died, and grief came so. Two did vision come to me. A rose for Jack Shea. About a rose on the foyer wall at Edinburgh Film House. See? See? A call and response. A rose for Jack Shea. A throb of folk, varied ages, dress codes, genders, gathers in the film house foyer, bright festival afternoon. They face a wall. A single red rose, though. under the rose, a beautiful script, a rose for Jack Shea. <laughs> Who is Jack Shea? Thunder's voice nowhere. Silence. Long. I am Jack Shea, shouts thin, indeterminate youth. I am Jack Shea, cries a woman of about sixty in dungarees, straw hat. I am. I am, I am Jack Shea, Jack Shea, Jack Shea, chunter, chunter, multitude voices, threads of poems, songs, slivers of argument, bristles, spins to the foyer. In the room, the song boys come and go. Wherever there's a fight so hungry eyes can feed, Jack Shea will be there. 
door and I trouble, big as the moon, little as a drop in the golden spoon. Hey, Jack Shay, high over in the leaves, up, up the hill we go. So it goes, so it goes. A rose, voice nowhere thunder. A rose, voice nowhere thunder, all still. A rose, say all, all whisper, all chant, all sing harmony. A rose, on the wall the red rose falls. Where it was, another come. Under the rose, in a beautiful strip, a rose for Jack Shea. See, see, Jackie Shea's main man was Caraway. See the path from Jackie Shea's Shepherds of Burnery, the founding of film school at Napier U, to last trip, best or worst trip, take your pick to who owns Jack Kerouac. Well, five quid later, I got to. One day later, took it to Turkish Taylor down the street from Himalaya and Green Tara. Asked him to fill the whole bread. He said, I have some. Brought beautiful, just right, First red, best red, bit of cloth, just enough to fill the hole in my story and memory. They gave me, Dick Stewart and Leo and Rika and Norbu Rose and Kenny and the tailor, my opening coat. Now I await the opening. Onto that radical road again, man. Onto that radical road.